So we're off to uh, Deer Creek Road in Mount Charleston this morning. Just driving through my neighborhood, going 15 miles an hour. And it's been hotter than hell here. It was 116 yesterday, which beat the record of 114 set a while back. And when I came out to my garage, <clears throat> I think it was about 115 degrees in there still. <laughs> Nothing like going from 75 degrees in your house out to 115 in your garage. So anyways, uh, got everything loaded up. Got the bike in the back of the vehicle. guy crossing the street with his dog so I haven't been up to Deer Creek Road for like just about a year and I'm looking forward to getting back up there I'm gonna do my um, offset seat mounted GoPro mount today and uh, I think that'll give us some interesting angle and footage going down Deer Creek Road at like 45 miles an hour. So we'll be back later when I'm climbing up that steep gradient, steeper around here. So see you in a few. There's uh, Mount Charleston up there, heading north on US 95. So about a year ago was the first time I parked here at Kyle Canyon Road in 95 and rode my bike all the way up Kyle Canyon Road to Mount Charleston up there. Yeah, the nice thing about coming for this early is there's like no one on the road. So we're probably about 60% of the way up to the hotel where I'm going to park my car. So here we are pulling into the Mount Charleston Hotel where I park my bike, or my car I mean, get out my bike, and then I ride up that hill. I see we got another cyclist over here. It's like a dude probably doing solo like me. Going up the first part of Deer Creek Road. It's only about 4% right here apparently. But it'll kick back up. Just taking it easy. I haven't done anything at this altitude for quite a while. I'm at probably 7,000 feet. That's where the hotel is down there where I parked. So I've come up a bit already.
All right, well, we did it. Went up to the high point of Deer Creek Road, the North Loop Trailhead. Did it in an hour. It took me like 51 minutes to get up and uh, <laughs> like 10 minutes to get back to the car. <laughs> That's hard, I had to stop a couple times. I'm not in the same shape I was a year ago, thanks to shingles. Uh, I knew it was gonna be a little interesting coming back down because I had a, apparently I've developed a cataract in my eye that had the shingles in it. So it's a nice little present from the shingles. It wasn't bad enough to screw up my eye, scar my cornea and permanently screw up my eyelid, but not had to give me a, a cataract as well. So in about three months, I guess I'm gonna be having surgery to fix that, so. Anyways, that was a success, and uh, feels good. I know I gotta work a little harder, get in better shape, but uh, it's about what I did last year. It took me about the same time. Uh, just cardio-wise, it just wasn't quite there, so. But all in all, I'm pretty happy. It's nice to get up to the mountains again. So until next time, Vegas Cycling Freak signing out.